So you've seen this Eiffel Tower shirt before in one of my videos. It's from Rue 21, it was thinning, so I didn't really enjoy wearing it. And so that, I used to have a lot of clothes that would require camis and I'm not about that life anymore. I'm all about that not wearing a bra life. Also, the benefit of wearing buying dark dresses is I can go braless in them whenever I can. So basically, I bought a sewing machine as soon as quarantine started. I've always wanted to learn just how to sew because I've always wanted to be a fashion designer and I've actually like drawn designs before. Um, but and my mom knows how to sew, but she never taught me. She didn't have time. And the sewing machine in our house like isn't good. Like the I don't, the needle and the thread keeps disconnecting. I don't know how to say it in English. But anyways, I like have so much more mad respect for her now because this is like a simple skill that I wasn't able to do at the beginning, but then I got the hang of it and I think I, I think I've got it now. And I feel like a selfish, not a selfish bitch, but see, no one thinks of these things, but I think of it myself. Like I have a sewing machine, yet I'm not wearing sewing masks for people. And I feel kind of guilty even though it's like not my responsibility to do those things, but I feel guilty because I see other people sewing masks, but I'm just over here sewing headbands and shit. I'm like, I'm a horrible human being. Why are people just, but then I remind myself, you're not, I'm not a horrible human being. Like there are other ways to do good and you're doing a lot of good. Yeah, I've been very insecure the past week because it's been a whole month since I've seen other people. <laughs> But anyways, back to the main topic. I took this, so because it's quarantine, I haven't been able to go outside and buy fabric to sew stuff, but I have started a bag. So a good thing to have is always a bag for you to donate stuff. Um, so and I fished this out of the bag, the shirt that I've been wanting to donate. And I cut out and I made some headbands because I don't own any headbands and I was, scrolling through Instagram I saw my friend Sarah she was wearing a headband in one of her stories I was like that's cute um so this one I first sewed this one's cuter because it has a thing but I don't know if I'll look cute right now but this one I sewed inside out so I didn't realize this is my first attempt um this I'll link the video down like there's a woman lady who has a great video and this is just a piece of fabric. This is the hem that I cut off. I just tied it around to create a cute little bow. And this one I actually made inside out. I meant not correct, not <laughs> correctly where the fab, the heat just turned on. Where the fabric is actually the right side up or whatever, but I still like it's still shaped weirdly. And the, the craftsmanship it's definitely not good right now because these are uneven pieces, not uneven pieces, but the I cut the fabric and it's not a neat square. So it's kind of ugly when I sew it in and I don't have like all the skills to know what to do, like how to prevent that or like get rid of it or whatever. So, cause yeah, I don't know if you can see the close up, but yeah, I messed up on the sewing. I had to sew this so that the thread is showing. But here we go. I don't know if I'll like I don't know if I'll ever actually wear these out in public, but it's cute.